What's up everyone? This is Siege the Day with Day by Day Farms. Let's get ready to siege this day. So today is Shane's birthday and I was going to save a parsnip for him, but it turns out I forgot to do that. And so we do happen to have the green bean that we have from yesterday, so we're going to give him the green bean. So as soon as we finish watering our crops, we will go give Shane a green bean. And then today, we are going to be working on getting uh, farther down in the mines. Hopefully we can get down as far as possible. Be really good if we could get down to level 20. We are hoping to get down to level 40. <sighs> Ideally by Monday, which honestly probably isn't going to happen but we are just going to do our very best and hope that we can get some iron before Wednesday because Wednesday is the flower festival and we would like iron so that we can make the recycling bin and I don't even have the recycling bin recipe yet so we're in a little bit of a predicament too because we need to fish a little bit more so that we can get to fishing for because that's when you get the crafting recipe for a recycling bin. So let's go back inside, drop off this copper that we had smelting all night. Perfect. And now we need to grab our green bean and see if Shane is at home. And if Shane is not at home, then we will do some other errands around while we wait for him to go to the bar because he also goes to the bar regularly. We do have our ax is currently at uh, Clint's getting upgraded. So we will have a copper ax. Uh, hopefully tomorrow or the next day opens at nine. Okay. See if there's any foraging to be done. Maybe we'll just clear some of this stuff while we're here. Because we don't have an axe, we're not going to be able to cut any trees down until we get that back. But it's nine now, so let's see if maybe Shane is at home or if we're going to have to stalk him a little bit later. Hopefully he's home. Hi Marnie! Yes I did! Thanks Shane! And of course Kiki is singing the song of her people. I'm not really sure what she wants, but it is probably to cause trouble and be mischievous. Alright, so let's see if we can get... Maybe let's catch a fish really fast from the river. We're gonna s check these two trash cans too really quickly. Oh, let's not fish right here though. I feel that deep in my soul, Sam. Yep, okay, so while we're here, let's just see if we can catch a fish really quick. And if we do, we will go to the mines, and if not, we'll still try going to the mines. Hopefully we can get 10 levels in, but I'm hoping for at least five because we've been able for all of our other fi um, mining trips, except for the first one, or except for the second one, I think. Most of our mining trips, regardless of how it goes, we have been able to get five levels in the mine, which is where the elevator stops are. And so that's always a good goal. Okay. That will at least help keep us a little bit better. It's better to go into the mines with at least a little bit of food. That would be really cool, Vincent. Yep. There is a special cutscene that I do want to get with Sam in the summer. So we'll have to remember to... Oh, that's going to be really good. 
Hopefully we get the same level of RNG that we just got with that trash can in the mine so that we can get down farther than we normally do. Excellent. It is kind of a big ask to get all the way to level 40 in the next couple of days, but we are doing what we can so that we can get the iron we need for the recycling machine for the cloth. We probably should have been working on this sooner, but I have been playing a little bit more chill. Oh, of course, this is the day that we all die. Okay, we kill these really quick and we don't have to worry about them. Perfect. Okay, it's dead. For those of you who don't know, if you let the larva sit there for too long, they harden into a cocoon, you can't hit them, and then they fly around. And this is a problem. Okay. We are not going to demonstrate if we can help it. Okay, perfect. Once again, we're going for distance. Okay, perfect. We are not hitting the big boulder because it is not something we can overcome. But if we see boxes or ore veins, we are going to try for them. Because you never know what might be in a box. Maybe food, maybe gems. We are saving up our geodes for a little bit later. I think we'll get our geodes processed when we go pick up our axe. Hopefully um, it's done by Monday and we can pick it up Monday. I shouldn't have done the axe upgrade so close to the weekend. Oh, there is the water down, perfect. Because if it's done tomorrow, I'm still not going to be picking it up. Because I do not want to bother people on Sunday with business. Okay. So we're going to have to eat our fish. It's a great mining snack. Just shove a whole smallmouth bass into our mouth. But we got it taken care of. This is less RNG than we got yesterday. So hopefully we do get down far enough to do some kind of good. Really hoping we can get down to level 20 at least. Because it doesn't really look like we will be able to get down to 25. But if we could get down to 20 that would be awesome. There we go. All we need to do is forage that. Perfect. And then we still have this horseradish so we can eat, which we should do now. Yep. Do we have any other? Ooh, we got a rice shoot. We will not be planting that this spring, but it is nice to have, and I'm glad we got far enough in the mine to get one at least. Okay. Ooh, topaz. There we go. Okay. Yep, we are definitely noping out of the mines now. Because we do not like big ol' bugs. So we did not make any more progress today on the mine. Let's just check in with the Adventurers Guild while we're here. So we have killed 21 out of 1,000 slimes, 9 out of two or 125 cave insects, and 3 out of 60 rock crabs. So if all of those give some kind of clothing. So we've got the leather boots. We could get sneakers if we had a little bit more money. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like we are getting any kind of clothing today. That's okay. 
We did get our clothing for the week. Oh, we already have a topaz. We can ship this at least. That'll work out. Yeah, we definitely need a rainy day for going into the mines. It would have been helpful if we had had this leak too. Oh well. Too late now. And that leak. Sorry for clicking too fast on you. It is. I love this area. It's super nice. It's not good for farming, but it is good for living because super cute. They probably get their cardio in, which is really nice. All right, now that we are absolutely devoid of energy on a Saturday, we should have gone, said hi to everyone in the saloon yesterday. That's what would have been good. Who has a quest for us? Yes, we had Shane's birthday. Who has the quest? Cave Carrot. To enjoy while reading Blue Tower. I wonder what that is. A book of some kind, probably. We don't have a cave carrot, unfortunately. Yes, sore arms make ghouls progress for a thousand push-ups yesterday. That feels like an exaggeration. But, you know, you do you, Alex. Okay, let's go forage on the beach and say hi to Willy. Ooh. How would you expand the fish shop stock? That would be cool. We do still need to get the fiberglass rod before we think about anything more serious than that so that we can put some of this bug meat to good use. But regardless, let's grab some corals on the beach. Doesn't look like anything else is here. But we can cra check our crab pot trap. See if we can get any more stuff to get put into the community center for the crab pot bundle. But it's trash. We will craft, craft, there we go. Some bait to put into our crab pot. We get the bait out of our hands so that we don't accidentally give it to someone that we are talking to. And let's go say hi to everyone at the saloon. Hi Clint, how are you doing? Yeah, that would be an interesting story. Alright, let's say hi to everyone. Okay. I gave you a birthday present. I'm just trying to be friendly. That's okay. He'll warm up to us eventually. Clint's more friendly than Shane, though. Okay. That's just the same repeatable dialogue. Once we get things that we can decorate with, I think we will be decorating for every season, too. Okay. Ah! I'm trying to talk to Pam, not sit down. But she didn't want to talk to me anyway. That's okay. Thanks, Gus. I think we're good for now. It is not easy to get cloth. I will definitely agree with you, Emily. Yep, it is a long trip to the city and we can't currently get there right now. That's kind of what currently means, I guess. And... Yep, it's not Friday night, so they're not playing pool. I thought I saw Sebastian coming this way. But apparently not. Alright, so we will do our trash can circuit. Which is awesome. Trash can. We must have gotten some of these trash cans already. Okay. Yep. They don't want to respond to me. That's okay. We are going to skip most of this cutscene. Or at least part of this cutscene. We don't want Shane getting us drunk, basically. I do not drink alcohol. And if you don't skip the cutscene... Oh, I do not want to have a drink. Thank you, though. 
Just say no. <laughs> it's unfortunate. I wish you could say no to having a, a, an alcoholic beverage with Shane. But unfortunately you can't. And so... The first time I had that cutscene, I didn't realize that it would actually give you the status effect of being drunk. And it makes you really slow, and so it's really accurate. It's really interesting, the level of detail, like I've said before, that's in this game. I just don't drink alcohol at all, and so... I unfortunately like Shane, but don't do that cutscene. So we'll just clear our inventory really fast. Oh, we've got seeds. So we'll sort all of that. And that, and we'll ship that. We'll keep these leaks. And I think most of the rest of this, yep, all the rest of this. And we'll ship this topaz. And there that is. And once again, it's a little bit early to turn in, but we don't have tons of energy and it is late. And so the forecast for tomorrow, partially cloudy with a light breeze, expect lots of pollen. So with that, everyone, we are going to head in for tonight. We can make staircases now, which is awesome. We're going to try mining tomorrow, see how far we can get. Unfortunately, breezes do not water our crops, so we are still going to have less than half energy. So hopefully we can find something good to forage. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. This has been Siege of the Day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks. Bye-bye.